Hello everyone. Welcome to Aptitude Jab. This set says that a DTC bus route from New Delhi to Indira Gandhi Airport has three intermediate stations: Shivaji Stadium, Dhola Kua, and Aero City. And it travels in this order: it starts from New Delhi and then goes to Shivaji Stadium, and then you have Dhola Kua, and then Aero City, and finally IGI. And the distance from New Delhi is given. It is three kilometer from New Delhi to Shivaji Stadium. New Delhi to Dhola Kua it is seven. So that means four from uh, Shivaji Stadium to Dhola Kua, fourteen. So seven from here to here and uh, Aero City to IGI it is sixteen. So a total of three, seven, fourteen, and thirty kilometer from New Delhi. Okay. So this is the distance given. Now about the fare for the first five kilometer, the fare is rupees twenty, which is fixed, and for every subsequent distance, it increases by rupees two per kilometer. So let us say a person has to travel from Shivaji Stadium to IGI. Okay, so the distance from Shivaji Stadium to IGI is twenty-four uh, plus seven plus sixteen, which is twenty-seven kilometer. Okay, so for first five kilometer, the person has to pay twenty rupees. And for the next twenty-two kilometer, it will be forty-four rupees. So a total of sixty-four rupees has to be paid by that person. So this is how you have to calculate the fare. Now some information is given about the number of passengers who boarded and got off the bus at certain stations. So first thing is given as exactly ten passengers boarded the bus at each of the stops. Okay, so ten, ten, ten at each of the stops and Then certain things about the number of people who got off the bus at different stations. So let us say the bus starts from New Delhi. Some people will got uh, get off at Shivaji Stadium, then at Dhola Kua, okay. then at uh, Aero City, and finally at IGI. Right now, when we talk about these numbers at uh, Shivaji Stadium, we have only those people who boarded the bus at New Delhi. Okay. For Dhola Kua, we will have people who boarded at New Delhi as well as Shivaji Stadium. For Aero City, we will have New Delhi, Shivaji Stadium, and uh, Dhola Kua. And these are the four kinds of people who get down at the station, right? Now, uh, let's fill in the information. It says only one passenger who boarded the bus at New Delhi got off at IGI. So this value is one. Then it is given that the number of passengers who got off the bus at Shivaji Stadium, Dhola Kua, and Aero City were two, seven, and thirteen respectively. So this total is two, seven, thirteen, respectively. Now this we can find out because there are forty people who boarded the bus, and two, seven, thirteen got off. So twenty-two. This is eighteen. So eighteen people got off at uh, IGI. Now these both of them belong to New Delhi, right? So they will belong to two categories. They will belong to these three categories, and then finally in this there will be ten from uh, uh, Aero City because uh, IGI is the last station. So all ten will get down at IGI, and we will have to find out these remaining values. Okay, for these two values we are given uh, a couple of more things. So which says that. Total fare collected from the passengers who boarded at New Delhi was three thirty four, and the total fare collected from passengers who boarded at Dhola Kua was three sixty eight. Right. So let us find out that how many passengers <coughs> travelled from New Delhi and uh, two different stations. So let us say this value is A, and this is B. Right. So let us find out the fares first. New Delhi to Shivaji Stadium. New Delhi to Dhola Kua. New Delhi to Aero City and New Delhi to IGI. Okay. Till Shivaji Stadium, it is just three kilometer, so fare will be twenty rupees. Now New Delhi to Dhola Kua, it is seven kilometer. Twenty for the first five kilometers plus two kilometers, it is four more. Twenty-four. Now New Delhi to uh, Aero City. Now this is this has already crossed that minimum limit, so we can just simply do seven into two, fourteen add कर लो. We will get thirty-eight. And then this is 
16 kilometers. So we will add 32 more. Okay. So you do not have to collect uh, uh, count from the initial again because that 20 kilometer barrier has already passed. So 32 kilo, 32 rupees more. That is 70 rupees. Okay. Now, <laughs> New Delhi to Shivaji Stadium. There are two people. Okay. And here there is one person. And let us say this is this number is A and this is B. Right. So we will get. Uh, 40 plus 70 that is 110 right and 24a plus 38b plus 110 equals total fare is 334 and the second thing is a plus b will be equal to 7 because total 10 people so let us multiply by 24 And when we subtract, we get 14B. Okay, and this is, uh, this is, uh, you will take 166 minus 110, that is 56. Okay, 110 either le jau, subtract kar loge, and subtract from this, we get 56. So, B is equal to 4. So, B is 4, then this number will be 3. Okay, so 3 people boarding from New Delhi. Uh, and getting down at Dhalakma. So that means four people from Shivaji Stadium who boarded at Shivaji Stadium will get down here. Okay. Now we have to, we have another similar condition. We will use it to find out the values. So it is given that uh, the fare collected from passengers who boarded at Dhalakma was 368. So Dhalakma, let us say this number is uh, B and this number is Q, right? So the fare from Dhola Kuwa to Aero City is like Dhola Kuwa to Aero City is 7 km. So 7 km, it means that uh, 5 for the first 5 km, it is 20. And then for 2, uh, two km, 4 more rupees. So 24 rupees. So 24p. And Dhola Kuwa to IGI, it is 16 km more. So 16 means 32 more. We will have 56. 56 Q that is equal to 368 and P plus Q is 10. So we'll multiply by 24. So we get 32 Q is equal to 128 or Q is equal to 4. Right? Q is 4. So that means 4 people here and six people here. Now we can find, subtract from the total 10, 13, and this is 15 and 3, 18. So this is the total uh, number of people traveling between different stations. Right now we can answer the questions. The first question is how many people boarded the bus at New, Del New Delhi and got off at Aero City? We already calculated it uh, previously itself. So one could answer at that instance itself. So uh, New Delhi to Aero City, we have four people. How many people boarded the bus at Shivaji Stadium and got off at IGI? Shivaji Stadium to IGI is three people. What is the total fare collected from the passengers who boarded the bus at Shivaji Stadium? So for Shivaji Stadium, we'll have to find out from uh, Shivaji Stadium to different places. Okay. So Shivaji Stadium to Dholakun, Shivaji Stadium to Aero City, Shivaji Stadium to IGI. Till Dholakun, it is just 4 kilometers, so 20 rupees. And there are 4 passengers. From Shivaji Stadium to Aero City, we have uh, 11 kilometers, so 5 kilometers, 20 rupees. Then 12 more rupees, 32. And last, we will add further 32 rupees, so 64 rupees from Shivaji Stadium to uh, IGI okay and there are three passengers here three passengers here so this is 80 96 192 okay so it again comes as 368 now the next question is what is the total fare collected from the passengers who got off at IGI Okay, so IGI got off at IGI means we will have to find the fare from these people. 
so new delhi to uh, uh, so we already know the fares from different places new delhi to igi is 70 rupees okay then shivaji stadium to igi is 64 into 3 we have already calculated this uh, dhola kuwa to uh, igi four passengers okay and uh, dhola kuwa to igi the fare is the fare is 56 rupees right and into 4 so we will get 224 okay, 56 rupees per passengers and aero city to igi the distance is 16 kilometer so for the first 5 kilometer you will pay 20 and for the next 11 kilometer 22 so total fare is 42 and 10 passengers so 420 rupees okay so this is 906 rupees the last question which of the following is maximum the number of persons who boarded at new delhi and got off at dholakua so new delhi to dholakua is 3 new delhi to aero city is 4 shivaji stadium to aero city is 3 and dholakua to aero city is 6 so this is the maximum so this was the solution to the set and the answers to the questions.